Bonjour, everyone. Welcome to Insert Topic here. My name is Vinny, the number one Irish commentator living in the south of France, and this is Insert Topic here, where I reply to your questions, suggestions, and topics. This week's going to be a bit different. Uh, this week, I'm going to be taking one topic on purpose, which is Proman, aka Hops, right there in the middle. Um, it's his question, actually, it's a question. And uh, yeah, I don't feel very qualified to answer him, but I will do my best. So, I'm going to be generating a random number on my phone right now because uh, I don't have internet on my PC. So, if you don't believe me, then go ahead and don't believe me. But, you know, I, this is what I'm doing. I wouldn't lie to you people. Um, generate. Three. Oh, I'm already using three. One. What's your opinion on stupid Swedes like <coughs> me? <coughs> okay. Thank you, Retro. That's a great topic. That's a great topic. Uh, I'll do one more. Four. What's your opinion on 1966 hippies eating five-year-old cheese on toast with a little bit of ketchup on the side? Well, one very, very serious topic and two very stupid ones. Uh, that seems about right. Okay, so let's get this party started. Gameplay is Modern Warfare 3. It's a very old one that I found on my hard drive uh, that I haven't used before. It was the only one I haven't used before. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's really it. Um, yeah, can't get, you know, I couldn't get any more gameplay due to lack of internet. So, yep, let's just go right on ahead and uh, look at the first question. Hey, Vinny, I'm having kind of a depression right now. Because my mother-in-law is such a bitch, she busses me around telling me to do my homework, acting like she's my mother, and I don't feel so good about that. She gets angry very easily, angry. So my question is, what should I say to her and how? Please help me, Vinny, all the best, hop. <sighs> okay, this is turning into Mail Monday. You know, I never intended for this series to be anything like a Mail Monday. And uh, Hop, I gotta tell you, I don't feel very qualified to talk about this. I don't feel very qualified to answer your question. And uh, I've been having a lot of trouble doing so. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna have another stab at this, right? Okay. So first, you say she's a bitch. She's bossing you around and telling you to do your homework, acting like she's your mother. Uh, you know. Uh, she is not there to replace your mother. That's what I'm thinking right now. I, I, I think, I don't think she thinks that she is replacing your mother either. Um, I, I, man, this is, this is, so, you know, she's not replacing your mother. And I, I don't think she's trying to replace your mother. I don't think she wants to just take over. I mean, you know, next you say she's acting, no, she gets very angry very easily. And she's trying, you know, and she's telling you to do your homework all the time. Well, telling you to do your homework isn't the worst thing. And, you know, if she's, you know, on your back, you know, on, you're on your back telling you to do your homework and telling you to uh, get ready for school, etc., etc., that means, you know, she cares about you and she wants you to... Uh, to succeed, you know, she's not trying to punish you, I don't think, I think, you know, from my perspective, from what you've told me, I think that she's just looking out for you, and, you know, maybe, um, maybe, you know, she gets angry a bit too easily, but, you know, I think a lot of mothers do, I think most, you know, mothers do that, I mean, my mom could be like, you didn't, Pick up your trousers off the bathroom floor. I will eat your soul. You, you know? I mean, women get over angry. I mean, they do. Okay? It's just something that happens. Okay? And, uh, you know, I think that uh, if you're really uncomfortable with the way she's acting and the way that she's talking to you and the way that she's, uh, you know, bossing you around, I think maybe you should confront her. Maybe... You know, tell her, okay, look, I'm not really, I'm not really comfortable with your attitude. I'm not comfortable with the way you speak to her. I think you're a bit too, you get a bit too angry every now and again. And, uh, yeah, I, I, and I also think that you need to, you know, try not to give her a reason to be angry at you. I think, try to give her, like, try to be on your best behavior. Like, if you've got homework or chores to do, I mean, this is my advice to anyone. You know, my next commentary is going to be about time management and managing your time and, you know, all of that. 
The best way, you know, is to come home and do your homework straight away. You've got the rest of the afternoon off or whatever you got your, your chores may be. You've got the rest of your time off to do whatever you want. And it's, uh, it, it's, it's a good feeling as well. So I think that you should, you know, probably do your homework straight away when you get home. I know it's kind of... It's kind of hard to, to do, I mean, it's kind of, you know, it's like you just got back from school and I have to do your homework, but trust me, if you do this, you know, your your mother, well, sorry, stepmother, will uh, look more kindly upon you. I mean, I, I think that if you do your homework straight away when you get home, it, it, it represents a sign of maturity, it makes you look more mature, it makes you look more, you know, uh, makes you look better, like it, it paints you in a better light, you know, it... You know, if you just, if you do your homework straight away, it'll be like, oh, okay, he, he's done it already. He's done everything. He's done his chores. He's done everything he needs to do. I don't have a problem with you know him doing any, you know whatever he wants. You know, so you know, try to be in your best behavior. Get your stuff that you need to do done as soon as you get home. That way, everything's done, and it, it's really is a good feeling. You've got everything done. You know, no pressure. And then um, I think uh, have a chat with your uh, with your stepmother, maybe your dad, uh, maybe talk to him as well. Talk to your stepmother. So let her know, yeah, I mean, I think you get a bit too angry and I'm not really comfortable with the way, you know, you talk or... I don't know. I mean, I'm not qualified to answer this question, but that is my insight. That's what I think. You know, that, that's my opinion. I, uh, uh, yeah, you you can uh, you can think about what I've said, um, you know. But, uh, yep, so, you know, confront your mother or... Oh, stepmother, damn it, your stepmother or your father and uh, just uh, try to get everything done when you get home. Chores, etc. Let's go to the next question. What's your opinion on stupid Swedes like cough me cough? Well, um, from reading this comment, I think you have a lot of uh, a lot of coughing issues. I mean, maybe you should you know get you know buy some cough syrup. You know, probably that'll probably help you. And uh, also, I like your women's boobs. Yeah, that's all I have to say about Sweden. No, but seriously, I love Sweden. I've been to Sweden once, and uh, I know it's pretty cool. And uh, Retros, you're amazing. Like you, like you are like the second. Swedish person I know, well, uh, third, fourth, I guess. I, I don't know many Swedish people. I know, like, you and someone else. And both of you, both of those people are really cool. So, yeah. Second weirdest question I have ever gotten on Insert Topic here. What is your opinion on 1966 hippies eating five-year-old cheese on, a to on toast with a little bit of ketchup on the side? Well, I feel very strongly on this opinion, on this topic. I mean, I have so much to say about it. It's so vast, and I just don't have time for it in this video. So I'm sorry. Um, thanks for watching the video, guys. I really do appreciate it. I thank you so much for supporting this series. If you do have a topic or a question or a suggestion or anything like that, please put it in the section below that has comments in it. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you can help me out. I will be picking them at random every week. Um, I, I mean, I had to t take hops today. I mean, it was a pretty serious one. But thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't, give it a thumbs down, and subscribe, etc., etc. Ciao, everyone.